Hey guys, Celtic Fire here, back in another part in Pokemon Fire Red. In the last part, we have faced Sabrina and I apparently forgot to heal in between parts. And in this part, we're going to head to our next destination, where the next gym leader is. However, on the way there, I think I'm going to fast forward again and play some music, so that way you don't have to watch that boring part, I guess. So this part's going to also be a little longer. That's also because I haven't uploaded recently. I apologize about that. But I've had school and other stuff I needed to do. Work. So, um, yeah. So this part's going to be a little longer. You're gonna During this part, Route 19, we're going to be sped up. And you'll be watching some Pokemon battles. I'll put in the description when you can hit... Or where you can start watching again when I start commentating. But there's a part I want to do in this part, and it wasn't getting to Cinnabar Island, our next destination. But Jolteon is going to be our main Pokemon for this bit of part, since it's going to be mainly water Pokemon. So, without further ado, let's speed up! Uh, I thought I'd stop the fast forward here just so you can see that there is the Articuna he Articuno here and you know what let's give it a try let's try catching Articuno after I see how many Pokeballs we have yes we have a decent amount so you know what I'll give it one try like one round of trying if it doesn't work it doesn't work if it works we got an Articuno so here we go after I save because if it doesn't work I'm gonna be turning it off Actually, I'll just be cutting, probably, but yeah. Here we go, Articuno. And there, and there's the first of the legendary bird Pokemon, Articuno. Articuno is a flying ice type, and if you need a flying or ice type, and you don't mind using legendary Pokemon, you can use Articuno. It's a pretty good Pokemon. And hopefully that does not freeze us. I do not want to be frozen right now. Dang it. Actually, it knocked me out. 
Um, yes, we'll use our next Pokemon. Um, let's use Middle King. Even though Ice is super effective against Ground type, let's just hopefully. Oh, okay, that's all right. I also don't have any Pokemon to use, like Spore or Sleep Powder on. I just realized so that's not good. Ooh, hello. All right, we got it in perfect range. So let's try an Ultra Ball first. Come on, Articuno. No, Articuno. Okay, that's odd. Um, let's use a Great Ball on it since we have a decent amount of Great Balls. Come on, Articuno. Uh, okay, it's going to keep using Agility and Junk on us. That's okay. Let's use a Pokeball. Let's just try it out. One. Dang it. Um, actually, I have ca caught an Articuno in a Pokeball once. I was just like, ah, oh, I don't I didn't, I have one Pokeball left. Let's just chuck it out there so that way I can get rid of it. And all of a sudden, it's like, one, two, three. I was like, no way. You did not just get caught in a freaking Pokeball. No, I'm not using my Master Ball in Articuno, even though it's a Let's Play and I won't be needing to worry about the Master Ball after this, I will be using it on something a lot harder to catch. So, that's going to be a lot later though. And yep, there goes King finally. Um, yes, we will use the next Pokemon. Actually, no, I forgot about that. I could make it go to sleep with Jinx. Come on, Jinx. Come on, Jinx. There we go. I forgot we had that move. So this will make Articuno a little bit easier to catch. Let's use that Great Ball again. And come on. One. Dang it. Yep, good. Still asleep. Now let's use the myth of... Downby! <laughs> yeah, Downby does not help. I know everybody's done it though. Everybody thinks that if you like rapidly tap the A or B button, it will make your Pokemon catch easier. Yeah, everybody's done it. Can't say you haven't done it because everybody's done it. So come on, Articuno. Come on, four more po or four more Great Balls, and then I'm gonna have to just say screw it. Okay, Articuno woke up, miss. I don't know what that move does exactly. I think it makes their it, it's facing this come up. Uh, but no, let's put it back to sleep real quick. And that should not be very effective. And take about half of our health, I believe. Yep, no, less than half. All right, there we go. Articuno is going to be asleep again. <clears throat> and let's chuck our last four great balls at it. If we don't catch it. I will run away and then load up my save again. I'll be cutting from that, but then I'll start up the music again. Some sort of music. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm going to use for fast forward music this time yet. Uh, but one, I can't get anything more than one, and it's at barely any health right now. Articuno, come on now. And two more great balls, come on. One. I can't get more than one. Articuno, will you at least do two? Make me feel happy. Make me feel good about myself. And okay, not very effective. One more. One more great ball. Okay, here we go. Nope. All right. Well, I'm going to load my save. I'm going to cut here, and I'll start up the music once I get back outside of Articuno. So I'll see you there. And then I'll also be talking again once I get to Cinnabar Island, so I'll, you'll hear me talking again at Cinnabar.
<clears throat> and we finally made it to Cinnabar Island, so what we're gonna do is come into the Pokemon Center and heal first because, yeah, I kinda got lost in the Seafoam Islands if you didn't notice. Uh, yeah, I kinda was like, where am I supposed to go? I don't know where I'm going. But, we finally reached the Cinnabar Island, so, <clears throat> well, now I can do the part I was going to do. Now you could go in here, um, yeah, I'll go in here, actually, because I do have something that you can put in here. I do believe we need to go into the third room. You can trade Pokemon in the first two rooms. I'm not sure what they are. I'll go over them maybe some other time. I'm not sure, but if you... Hiya, I'm an important doctor. Yes, very much so. I do, 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 do. You have a fossil for me. Yes, I have the dome fossil. Um, so now you can <clears throat> give him your fossils that you have. There's another fossil we haven't got yet. Um, the other fossils are really good Pokemon, so I would re if you need a rock or flying type, definitely recommend the next, or the other fossil. So, uh, we got a Kabuto. Kabuto is a rock and water type. It is the more offensive of the two fossils you could get in Mount Moon. The other one is Omanite. Omanite is more defensive, also rock and water type. But, I will not be using neither on my team, so... What we're going to do is I'm going to actually shop at the Pokemon real quick, so I will meet you at side. Alright, now that we're outside the Pokemon, uh, we could try going in here, but as you can see the door is locked, so we can't go in there yet. So the most logical thing to do is to go in here. <laughs> uh, we are now in the Pokemon Mansion. Uh, you can find lots of different Pokemon in here. I'll maybe put an annotation off to the side what Pokemon you can get. Can't guarantee I'll do that though. Because I'll probably forget I said that, but we'll see. Um, looks like Jolteon needs an HP up. But uh, I know you can get Growlithe and Dittos. Ditto is a good Pokemon to get if you are trying to breed, which you can't do yet, but you can later. But I'm going to use a Max Repel in here. And we can run, but we can't use our bike. Interesting. Uh, but I'll just be exploring this a little bit. Let's see what we got for items in here. We got an escape rope. That's a good, so just in case we need to get out of here quickly. Um, there's an item over there, we can't get it yet. And some stairs, another thing over there. So what you're, the trick of this place is you're going to want to find these statues right here, these Mewtwo statues. And I guess you have to stand in front of them. Come on, there we go. Secret switch, press it, there we go. And we can battle some of the trainers, but I'm not going to unless you're... <laughs> Oh, excuse me, unless they're required. Um, we got a protein here that's nice to have. Now let's head up the stairs. <clears throat> and we got another Mewtwo statue. I don't believe we. there's anything down there. Is there anything down here? Yes. That was 250 steps already. Oh, let's use our protein while we're here. Uh, base attack. Who's our attacker? Nidoking is an attacker, so Sephiro. We'll give it to Nidoking. So... Now we'll continue on our merry way. What's here? The zinc. We got more vitamins. And in here we got a notebook. I guess a book, whatever. Uh, there we go. We'll need to take that down a little bit, but let's explore some more. See what the items are in here. Another notebook. Here's an item. Uh, calcium. It looks like we're going to be finding a lot of vitamins in here. So that, there's nothing wrong with getting the vitamins. When I was little, I didn't understand what the vitamins did, and I would just sell them off, because, yeah, I didn't understand. Raising attack is good. So, now we're going to head up these stairs. And we got another Mewtwo statue. We're not going to go there yet. We're going to get the item over here, which is iron. Uh, looks like the only one we haven't got yet is... No, we've gotten protein, haven't we? I don't know what it is, then. Interesting. Oh, well. Use another Max Repel while we're here. We'll use our Zinc and Calcium Special Defense. Our Special Defender is probably Blastoise. I would say Blastoise. I'm not sure off the top of my head. Um, calcium Special Attack. That is, we'll give that one a Jinx. And then the Cal or the Iron is Defense, and that is definitely more none of them. <laughs> Actually, off the top of my head, I would say it's probably Nitto King, since so he's more the attack and defense person. But let's continue on our way. Did I push that button? I think I did. 
I'm not sure. Oh, we definitely we have to battle him, but let's not do that yet. Let's hit the statue. And let's go in here. And here we have absolutely nothing. So I don't know why I did that. It's a waste of a max repel. Uh, right, yep, there we go. Press it, and we do have to battle him. I think we're going to want to switch to a Nitto King here. And my mentor once lived here. And here we go. We got scientist Brayden. Brayden's gonna start off with the Magnemite, which is not what I was expecting it to start off with. But that's okay. It doesn't have levitate, which I figured out last time. Uh, I fought a Magnemite, so let's dig it, dig dug, and it's going to try to lock on us, but it's not going to, and then this will be super effective. Bye, Magnemite. And maybe level up? No, okay. Magneton, we'll keep Nidoking out there, it needs to level anyway, it's lagging behind level-wise. So let's dig again. Um, this is the only Pokemon out of the Generation 1 Pokemon in this game that gained another type from the Generation 1 games. Uh, in Generation 2 they added Dark and Steel type, Steel being very very defensive and resisting a lot of different types and Dark being more of a special attacker. And, uh, but in the Generation 1 games the only one that added one of those types is Magna Magnemite and Magneton. They added the Steel type so now it's Electric Steel type which makes it a lot harder to take out, but it makes Magnemite a decent Pokemon. So it resists, it resists a lot of things. So Magnemite in its evolution Magneton and its evolution Generation 4 onwards, Magnezone, is a very good Pokemon. I recommend it. But there we go. We defeated Brayden. Let's check what's down these stairs. And we got HP up. So we use an HP up, we got another one in here. Uh, but let oh, come on now. There we go. And now let's drop down the thing that was right in front of him. And now we're in another level of the Pokemon Mash Mansion. There we go. Have we already been here? We have already been here. I didn't went off the wrong one, didn't I? Gosh darn it. Let's go back upstairs. Or did I? No, I didn't. No, I haven't been here. I did go off the right place. Hold on. I'm so confused. I'm confusing myself. Let me figure out. Let me get my bearings first. No, okay. Okay, so we want to go up. Do we want to go up? No. Maybe. We, we do want to go up. We just don't want to go up yet. We need to find another stairs. Oh, I forgot to do a repel. Alright, we got ourselves a Growlithe here. I do believe I mentioned that, but Growlithe, I think in the old games there used to be Mag or Magmars here. Not sure if they're in this they're in the mansion in this game, but if there are, it'd be a good Pokemon to get for a fire type. What is my cat doing? I don't know why it's running away from something. Oh well, I'm gonna catch this Growlithe just because we need more Pokemon. Because uh, we're, we are approaching something that I think I need a minimum of 60 Pokemon to do. And I only have about probably 20 something. So yeah, I need to start catching some Pokemon. I'll do most of them off screen, but as you can see, got a Growlithe here. I did catch that Psyduck on screen because it was one level away from evolving to a Golduck. So why not? I don't I think I even have a Rattata. But again, I'll catch more off screen. So... Probably be going to Route 1 and be catching all those easy Pokemon like Rattatas and Mankeys. And I know they're not on Route 1, but they're on the first couple routes. And then Pidgeys. Pidgeys are easy to catch. Just I'll be going for easy Pokemon to catch. Maybe try to evolve them. I just need an experience share, most likely. Um. I think we want to... <sighs> Dang it. I swore that was the drop-off you want to do. Maybe it's this one. There we go. Okay. Now I know where we are. 
Uh, and this guy is required, so let's keep our... No, he's not required, sorry. And we found a Carbos. That was the other vitamin I was thinking of. Okay. And if you want, you could exit out of the building right there. We're not going to because there's something downstairs that we need. So let's head on through the place. And what's down here? A person. Oh, I'm surprised we didn't have to battle in there. That was close. And let's press the switch because I believe there's an item we need over here. Um, let's pop another repel. Even though there are dittos down here. If you, So maybe after this repel wears off, I'll try to find a ditto. I'll give it like two tries. Uh, full restore. Those are excellent items to have, especially once we get to the Elite Four. Uh, but head up here. Dang it! He was not required. I just didn't know he was up there and had such great line of sight. Uh, LOS. But I'll show this on screen. So, well, it depends. Yeah, only two Pokemon, that's not bad. And these scientists seem to be going for the Magnemite route, and Electra and Voltorb, I was expecting them to go for Grimers. And Mucks. Another, and Coughings, the poison type route, but that's okay. Magnemites we can handle too. And super effective. Bye bye, Magnemite. Well, as long as we have Nitto King, we can handle Magnemites. I don't know what other types I could use to take it out, but Electrode. Let's use. Oh, uh, let's go crazy. Let's use our Ziggs. Ziggs. Alright. Um, yeah, let's use Mega Kick on it, actually. Oh, uh, that might paralyze us. Yep. I didn't say Spark seems to usually have a high percentage of paralyzing, but... Oh no, it's starting to roll out. And that's super effective against Jinx! Oh no, this could be bad. Come on, Jinx! Land a freaking attack! Let's use Psychic on it, then. Oh good, it missed. <laughs> that could've been bad. And... That should... Oh, that was close. Let's just Ice Punch it, then. There we go, it's gonna start another rollout, hopefully the paralyzing or the paral paralysis there <laughs> trying to say it and it does take over. Uh rollout, this is gonna take it almost out, if not all the way out. Okay, yeah. One more rollout and Jinx is done, but that's okay. Cause you are done electrode. And Jinx leveling up to level forty, alright. So we got two level forty Pokemon now, our Jolteon and Zerbs Zinx. Which we will be could use Zinx for the gym after this one, but I think I know which Pokemon I'll be using more of. Well, let's continue on our way. What's up here? TM14 Blizzard. Oh, this is a great move to have. We could either give it to Jinx or I could give it to Blastoise. I was thinking about giving Blastoise a nice type move since the beginning. <sighs> or I could give it to Nidoking. Well, I don't think I'm going to. Or Gyarados. Let's just see what, uh, because Jinx can naturally learn Blizzard, that's the problem, and it's leveling up pretty fast. So you know what, I'm going to give it to Blastoise, actually, because I think Jinx learns it naturally, like I said, in about 15 more levels or so. I don't know if I'll be able to get to 15 more levels by the time we get to the Elite Four, but I'm hoping we can get close. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of Pretty... Do I need bite? I'm trying to think if I need bite anywhere in the future. Yes, I do. But so does but Gyarados has it too. Um, this is our choice. I'm gonna get rid of bite with Blastoise. I'll use Gyarados if I need to. So I can take the black glasses off of Blastoise now. So, Blastoise learned Blizzard. I know it's not a stab for Blastoise, but that is okay with me. Um, let's head this way. And in here, we're going to find the thing that we came in here for. The secret key, which is going to open up the gym. And down here, we're going to find TM22 Solar Beam, which is a very good grass-type move. If you can use Sunny Day with it, perfect. 
Um, I don't think anybody can learn on my team learn Solar Beam. Maybe Nitto King can. No, nobody can. So we're not gonna be using it anyway. Um, brick break. I have a lot of moves that I could be teaching to people. But that's okay. I think I'm gonna head out here and end the episode. So if you like this part, I'd appreciate a like. Any thoughts, comments, concerns, or complaints, leave them below. And actually, I'm going to ask you a question. Since we're ending near of this LP, any suggestions for my next LP? I have some ideas in my head, but I just want to see if any of you out there watching me are going to suggest the same things I am thinking of right now. They don't have to be Pokemon games. I don't have a... Uh, what are those things called? Capture cards, so I can't use any games on my Xbox or anything, but I could do any computer games. But, yeah, I just wanted to see if any of you had the same games in mind as I did, but leave them in below in the comments section, but till next time, have a good day.